Working with sections helps to keep both your word processing and page layout documents organized, and different sections can use entirely different layouts and styles. You can see the sections in a document by selecting Page Thumbnails from the View pop-up menu in the toolbar. A gray line marks the sections. Some sections are one page and others are multiple pages. If you need to reorganize your document, you can pick up and move entire sections. And best of all, if your document has a table of contents, it will automatically stay updated. Adding a new section is easy. Just choose one from the Add Sections pop-up menu in the toolbar. There's a variety of styles based on the template you're using. To split a long section into two, just place the cursor where you want the new section to start. Then go to the Insert menu and choose Section Break. The concept is similar when working with page layout documents with one small change. In a page layout document, each individual page is a section. Instead of an Add Sections menu in the toolbar, you'll see an Add Pages menu, where you can select from a variety of layouts based on the template you're working from. Working with sections makes building multi-page word processing and page layout documents a breeze.